central London this morning because we have a meeting with Westfield who I just recently worked with on my blog and I think they want to talk to us about working with us on our YouTube channel. chuffed because our national trust cards have just come today. Next stop, death. I'm a big boy. You're a big boy. Yeah. I know you are. I'm a big boy. <laughs> is a rally. It's starting in about five minutes. What's happening now in the Labour Party is there is something they call a coup. They're trying to get out Jeremy Corbyn. I'm a big fan of Jeremy Corbyn. I'm a big fan of his politics and I want him to be our next Prime Minister. The Prime Minister after the next one potentially. I'm going to take you guys down to this protest now. <laughs> Corbyn is in theatre. I think that's the thing that's so appealing about him. It's just, it's raw and it's honest. And that's the kind of politician people need right now. As you can hear. Powerful stuff, man. It yeah, it was really intense. I can't believe that a politician can like, unite that many people. Who do you imagine going down for like and rallying for Tony Blair or rallying for like Gordon Brown or rallying for like David Cameron? Nobody would do that. England versus Iceland, it's just kicked off. All the Icelandic men are so much more attractive than the English The national anthem's dreamy as well, isn't it? It's really calming mm, I love and it. it feels like you're in church or something. Yeah. It's really nice. And all the men from Iceland, pretty much all of them have blue eyes, which is kind of nice to look at. Well, that's what Hitler wanted, isn't it? He thought everyone should have blue Let's eyes. Let's not talk about Hitler. You've already talked about politics, well, honey. Just. I'm just saying, you're the one that you're the one that thinks um, everyone should have blue eyes like Hitler does. Ooh, that was close. We got a penalty. We got a penalty. Rooney's about to take it. Yes. 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 Say yes. Why men so annoying? Say yes. Yes. I wish that was him. I've managed to polish off about half a bottle of wine by myself because I know that Steph ditching me for the football. So I'm going to do a chive update because I haven't done one for ages, and I have to have a drink before I do a chive update. 
I don't think you guys are gonna believe me, but this is the original chive. It's about a year and a half old, and it is the most non-high maintenance plant ever. But I trimmed it the other day when Steph's mum was over, because she told me to. And look, look, that is a flower. That is a chive flower. We're back in business. Zach's in the house. Hello. England. Oh my God. Iceland, population 325,000. How on earth are they beating us? I told you, it's because they have loads of time to practice. Hannah's logic is basically, because there's nothing to do in Iceland, that they have loads of time to practice they football do. and that's why they're winning. Coney, that's not... It's half time and Iceland are winning 2-1. We have never needed England to win as much as we need them to win now. We are a divided nation. Football could potentially unite a few of us and... <sighs> doesn't like it's gonna... It needs to be like a creepy little place, doesn't it? Wait, yeah. Hey, Steph, you wanna come and help me with this? No! No! Oh my days. Oh. A wretched night. It is a wretched it? night. It's the most wretched night ever. Oh no. Oh. Oh god, now England's gonna be even more Oh, depressed. this is they not don't know that sad, what we need. They don't know that sad. They shit. That is not what needed to happen right now. We're not one of the big boys anymore. Oh. Not one of the big boys anymore. My God, man. Well done, Iceland. God. The most Ab abject failure. He called it wretched. Wretched, ab abject wretched. failure. Quote of the night, abject He's the best failure. looking Iceland player, the one with the cheekbones and the long hair. But he needs to don't shave. Listen, don't make it Sorry. worse. <laughs> Sorry. I'm deleting our Iceland video. <laughs> Feet from last night, you know. You will be. I know. We are in. Where are we? Kensington Gardens. Kensington Park. Kensington Park. Mission where Gracie helped. Yeah. Much. yeah. Doing a bit of a park tour recently. <laughs> I used to ignore parks when I was younger. This is we had Grace in. I'm now all about parks. I wonder what that's for over there. It looks awful. cynical in your old age. I'm just cynical right now because we're a nation divided and we lost the football. At least we're not a marriage divided. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine if he never grows out of Bubba. Imagine if he's like in his 40s clutching onto this little horrible okay. puppet toy thing. Do you want strawberries or a little cake thingy? They sell some of the best sushi we've ever eaten in London near here. So we're gonna finish our little walk and then go and um, stock up on some sushi. Yeah. Here's your sushi. <laughs> You're so cute. Do you want some sushi, Grayson? But this is yeah, what Grayson would look do. like with brown hair. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Got brown hair! <laughs> <laughs> it's so hard being two. It's so hard when you're two years old and everybody does everything for you. Grayson can basically be in bed and be like, I want drink! And then like he'll have a drink within like 30 seconds. Jeez. Basically, I'm a servant. Yeah, you are a servant. I, did, I wish I appreciated it more when I was a toddler. They never appreciated it. Did you pass him a drink, please? It's in, the, it's in the bag. If I went like, if I kicked my feet and went, I drink, you'd slap me.
Wagamamas. Waggers. Waggers. My stomach is eating itself. So I've this ordered. This is the best smoothie it's good, isn't ever. It? Mm. So good. If anyone ever comes into Wagamamas, get the super green. It's so good. I'm trying to drink it all quickly before the boys both realise how good it is. Thank you very much. This is called the firecracker and it is hotter than the sun. It's that special time, it's that special time, it's reality versus expectation. Um, right, this is re um, expectations. I cannot believe, etc, etc. Et I actually think this one looks better in reality. This one smells so, well yours looks better. Reality. Mine looks like mush. Yeah, I'm oh, sorry, I, I, my, my presentation is a bit better. But is yeah, it? like, look at those. Forgive this me. is better. I'm happy with that. Oh my god, it's so good. Is it good? Mm. Chimichurati sweet potato and goat's cheese no, and chorizo salad. No, not Chimichurri. Chimichurri. Chimichurri sweet potatoes, goat's cheese and chorizo salad. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> that really hurt. I was trying to be. I was trying to be all cool. I was trying to be like a little cool and Casey Neistat. And You're not like, cool. Like a massive knob. You're um, not yeah. slick, honey. No, when I'm are you going to realise that? Grayson, stop it. Hello everyone, we're at Henley Regatta. Grayson's being a savage. Along with some <laughs> other members of Henley Regatta. Henley Regatta is a boat race they have in Henley, which is about an hour away from us. They have it once every year. It's for, it's for posh people. There's loads we're of- We're trying to mingle amongst the posh people without standing out too much. Yeah, but I haven't got a blazer on, so I just look like an absolute ruffian. They all talk like this as well. Shh, really loud. Sorry, am I? Oh. Anyway, we didn't go last year, but We've come this year. We thought, why not go to Henley Regatta, take you guys with us, have a look at some boats, have a look at some water, have a look at some posh people. We have a two, year, two and a half year old, no nap toddler, so just trying to deal with that. It's quite, um, I don't think it's stressful, it's just irritating. <laughs> like he's doing stuff on purpose. That's He knows what will irritate me, like picking up my handbag and going and putting it down on the floor. Just taking all his stuff out and throwing it all over the grass. Jason, do you want to say hello to everyone? Hi guys. Hey guys. Thank you. Hey guys. You stay there, like that. <laughs> stay there and let mummy and daddy finish talking to everybody. So we're gonna go and check this place out now. We're gonna go for a little walk, aren't we, Meander? Mm -hmm. Meander down there. I need the ice cream. And Grace apparently Grace needs, needs an, ice cream. an ice cream. What kind of ice cream do you want me to get you? Um, Daddy, you have almonds. Okay. What colour are you gonna have? Mm. Mm. 
Ooh. If we get you an ice cream, will you walk nicely with us? Yeah. You won't be a naughty boy? Um, yeah, so you'll be a good boy. You'll be a good boy, yeah. Okay, we'll get you an ice cream then, okay? Only the big boys have the ice cream. Only the big boys have the ice cream. I feel like I need a blazer. Gonna fall off of this earth Cause I'm living low And I fear that I've wasted all the wisdom that I know And I dream of a place somewhere To disappear with colors they rain A shower made a new friend and he has found a car to sit in. He's driving a Tesla right now, <laughs> look. Hi, Mummy. Hi. Thinking back to all the days when we were kids, playing games and dropping hints and getting wide-eyed at a glimpse. And I was about to turn on as a bottom feeder lights the sun. Just finally gone up with the rest Like some long extinct big creature That we've never seen in flesh Who suppose that every reigning chap eventually Makes us better You hungry? Let's be going <laughs> We're going to get some food Oh <laughs> Gracie, have you had a fun day? Um, you... No I'm going to go chat up by a Tesla man who was, um, they basically had this big Tesla in uh, on the river. I think you saw some shots of Grayson in it, and this guy was like, hey. And then, uh, you, you <laughs> TJ. Know, you, yeah, TJ, I said, hey, I'm TJ. And then Hannah was like, yeah, it's my, this is my child, Grayson. He's like, what do you mean, your child? And then stopped speaking to it altogether. <laughs> I could have completely misread the circumstances because, let's face it, I haven't been in the dating game since we dated, so maybe he wasn't flirting with me, but I just noticed a distinct <laughs> lack of conversation after he was like, oh, so he's your son. <laughs> it, there was a distinct lack of conversation after that, whereas before he was like, yeah, Grayson, you can get in the boot, we'll do this, it's really fun, and then he was like, oh, he's yours. Did you have fun today? Yeah, it was really good. Yeah, I had Did a good time. Did you have a good time? I had a really good time. It was more yeah. chilled vibe than it was last yeah. time, but it was good. Grayson happiness is hardwired into our happiness so if he's happy we're happy he made and he was, so he many had a friends great day. but next year let's maybe find a babysitter white hill woods does that private. not sound it's very private look yeah somebody owns exactly. that exactly white hill woods private Sounds you can like... imagine getting murdered in white hill woods well if it's private if you were a murderer and you're a rich murderer that felt like murdering murder lots of people then no one can go in your woods so of course you're going to bury yeah. people in your woods white hill woods god that's creepy <sighs> let's say goodbye now okay Right, we're going to go back now and have some food. Oh, that was wrong before. <laughs> Please keep that in. Right, we're going to go home now and we're going to sign off because, well... We'll see you in the morning when we do our outro. <laughs> see you in the morning when we do our outro. Bye, guys. Bye. Love you. Thanks for coming to Handy with us. Bye. It's like abuse. Is it like Le when you breathe in my face at night time? I breathe. <laughs> Hannah's, Hannah gets annoyed me because I breathe at night time. Like I an breathe. old man. And she just, she's just. You go like this. <sighs> you know what would be worse? If I snort, I just breathe. I'm just like. <sighs> it's I nice, wish you it's nice like... breathing. She just hates it because it's, it's a constant, constant reminder that I'm alive. I have to basically have my head on my pillow. You're allowed to, to breathe. Just through like your that. mouth. To try and like. That's mean I don't breathe loudly. Maybe that's making it worse. It's making me really paranoid. I think that's making it worse. No, it's not. It's making it better. Trust me. I get kicked less now. <laughs>
<laughs> you only get kicked less because I, I can't sleep on the very, very That's what happens if you get married, guys. Any couples watching that haven't got married, you start, you start resenting the other person breathing. I'm not resenting it. It's just very loud and hard to sleep through. Okay, right. Let's move on swiftly. You've got a blog post. <laughs> What's I it about? I have a blog <laughs> right, interviewer. <laughs> now, tell me. What's it about? I have a new blog post. Um, it is... What is it? About Iceland. <laughs> About Iceland, the dream stealers who stole the dream of us being a united nation. I have a new blog post. It is photos from our trip to Iceland, which was quite a few videos back now, but I've only just got around to blogging about it. So I'm going to put that down below in case anyone wants to go read it. And... you got a video on your channel. I have a video on my channel. Yeah. So three questions. Forgot about that. Thanks, Steph. It's all right. There's a new video on my new channel. Which yes. doesn't talk about politics or football. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> no Brexit chat. No. Well, you did mention Brexit. Yeah, the question was... Don't, say, you... don't, don't tell anyone. You go and see what the Brexit question is. Go and see what the Brexit question is. <laughs> right, anyway, thanks for watching. So, uh, guys, um, really appreciate... said we weren't going to mention the word. I know, I shouldn't have done that. We're going to be hated now. Anyway, let's not go into that again. Uh, let's move on quickly. Um, right, thanks for watching. We'll see you all next week for more adventures. Have a great week, everyone. Bye! Bye.